church during these hardships and times wanted to come together and put together our annual pageant. During this time of the holiday season, we all decided it would be better to come together as one, but obviously not at the same time, to prove that God loves us and is always with us. Even during these hard times, we can bring joy to people's Christmas and holiday season. Enjoy the pageant. Let the sea roar and all that fills it. Let the world and all those who live in it. Let the whole creation sing for joy at the presence of God who is coming. God is coming indeed to judge the earth with righteousness and peoples with equity and truth. Praise the Lord. Come now, O Prince of Peace, make us one body. Come, O Lord Jesus, reconcile all people. Come now and set us free, O God our Savior. Come, O Lord Jesus, reconcile all people. They heard the sound of the Lord God walking in the garden at the time of the evening breeze. And the man and his wife hid themselves from the presence of the Lord God amongst the trees of the garden. But the Lord God called to the man and said to him, Where are you? He said, I heard the sound of you in the garden and was afraid because I was naked and I hid myself. He said, Who told you that you were naked? Have you eaten from the tree of which I commanded you not to eat? The man said, The woman whom you gave to me to be with, 
She gave me the fruit from the tree, and I ate. Then the Lord God said to the woman, What is this that you have done? The woman said, The serpent tricked me, and I ate. second time from the heaven and said by myself I have sworn says the Lord because you have done this and have not withheld your only son I will indeed bless you and I will make your offspring as numerous as the stars of heaven and the sand that is on the seashore and your offspring shall possess the gate of their enemies and by your offspring shall all the nations of the earth gain blessing for themselves because you have obeyed my voice Upon the throne of David and over his kingdom, 
to order and establish it with judgment and justice from that time forward, even forever. The zeal of the Lord host will perform this. <laughs> shall rest upon him, the spirit of wisdom and understanding, the spirit of counsel and might, the spirit of knowledge and the fear of the Lord. His delight is in the fear of the Lord. He shall not judge by the sight of his eyes, nor decide by the hearing of his ears, but with righteousness. He shall judge the poor and decide with equity for the meek of the earth. He shall strike the earth with the rod of his mouth and with the breath of his lips, he shall slay the wicked.
Nazareth, to a maiden betrothed to a man, whose name was Joseph, of the house of David. The virgin's name was Mary, and having come in, the angel said to her, Rejoice highly, favored one, the Lord is with you, blessed are you amongst women. But when she saw him, she was troubled by what he was saying, and considered the manner of greeting this was. Then the angel said to her, Do not be afraid, Mary, for you have found favor with God, and behold, you will conceive in your womb, and bring forth a son, and shall call him Jesus. He will be great, and he will be called the Son of the Most High, and the Lord God will give him the throne of David, and he will reign over the house of Jacob forever, and of his kingdom there will be no end. Joseph, her betrothed, on learning of her condition, being just a man and not wanting to make her a public example, was minded to end the relationship secretly. But while he thought about these things, behold, an angel of the Lord appeared to him in a dream, saying, Joseph, son of David, do not be afraid to take Mary as your wife, for that which is conceived in her is of the Holy Spirit, and she will bring forth a son, and you shall call his name Jesus, for he will save his people from their sins. So all this was done, that it might be fulfilled, which was spoken by the Lord through the prophet, saying, Behold, the virgin shall be with child, and bear a son, and they shall call his name Emmanuel, which is, which is translated to God is with us. When Joseph, being aroused from sleep, did as the angel of the Lord commanded him and took Mary home to be his wife. And it came to pass in those days that a decree went out from Caesar Augustus that all the world should be registered. This census first took place while Quirinius was governing Syria. So all went to be registered, everyone to their own city. Joseph also went up from Galilee, out of the city of Nazareth, into Judea, to the city of David, which is called Bethlehem, because he was out of the house and lineage of David, to be registered with Mary, his betrothed wife, who was great with child. So it was, while they were there, that the time came for her to be delivered of her firstborn son. Now there were in the same country shepherds living out in the fields, keeping watch over their flocks by night. And behold, an angel of the Lord stood before them, and the glory of the Lord shone around about them, and they were very afraid. Then the angel said to them, Do not be afraid, for behold, I bring you good tidings of great joy, which will be for all people, for, for to you this day. In the city of David is born a Savior, who is Christ the Lord, and this will be the sign for you. You will find the babe wrapped in swaddling clothes, clothes and lying in a manger. And suddenly there was with the angel a multitude of the heavenly hosts praising God and saying, Praise be to God in the highest, and on earth peace, good will to men. Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace, goodwill towards all people. So it was, when the angels had gone away from them into heaven, that the shepherds said to one another, Let us go to Bethlehem to see what has come to pass, that the Lord has made known to us.
And they came quickly and found Mary, Joseph, and the baby lying in the manger. Now, when they had seen him, they made it widely known, the saying which told them concerning the child. And all those who heard marveled at those things which were told to them by the shepherds. But Mary kept all these things and pondered them in her heart. Then the shepherds returned, glorifying and praising God for all the things they have heard and seen. Go down on the mountain, over the hill, and everywhere go down on the mountain, where Jesus was born. Go down on the mountain, over the hills, and everywhere go down on the mountain, where Jesus Christ is born. Search carefully for the young child, and when you have found him, bring back word to me, so that I may um, come and worship him also. When they heard the king, they departed, and behold, the star which they had seen in the east went before them, till it came and stood over where the young child was. When they saw the star, they rejoiced with exceeding great joy. They saw the child with Mary, his mother, and fell down and worshipped him presenting him with the gifts, gold, frankincense, and myrrh. We three kings of Orient are bearing gifts, we traverse afar. 
field and fountain, moor and mountain, following yonder star. Oh, star of wonder, star of night, star with royal beauty bright. Glorious now, behold him arise, King and God and sacrifice. Hallelujah, hallelujah, sounds through earth and skies. Star of night, star with royal beauty bright, westward leading, still proceeding, guide us to thy perfect light. In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. He was in the beginning with God. All things were made through him, and without him nothing was made that was made. In him was life, and the life was the light of the men, and the light shines in the darkness, and the darkness did not comprehend it. That was the true light which gives light to every human coming into the world. He was in the world, and the world was made through him, and the world did not know him. He came to his own, and his own did not receive him. But as many as received him, to them he gave the right to become children of God. To those who believe in his name, who were born, not of blood, nor of the will of the flesh, nor of the will of humans, but of God. And the word became flesh and dwelt amongst us. And we beheld his glory, the glory as of the only begotten of God, full of grace and truth. Mm -hmm. 